Good morning. This is Asha here from the Department of Mechanical Engineering. Today we are going to discuss about the special type of problems in projection of planes. The problem goes like this. So the top view of a square lamina of side 30 mm is a rectangle of sides 30 by 20 mm with a longer side of the rectangle being parallel to both HP and VP. Draw the top and front views of the square lamina and what is the inclination of the lamina with respect to HP and VP. So here the lamina is a square lamina of size equal to 30 mm. And if you look carefully into the problem, they have not given whether it is lying on HP or lying on VP. Instead of that, he says that rectangle of sides 30 mm by 20 mm with a longer side of the rectangle being parallel to both HP and VP. So here they have not given inclination with respect to HP and VP. We need to find out those inclinations. Apart from that, the square, the top view of a square lamina, the square will look like a square in the top view. So they have given the square will look like a rectangle in the second position with the longer edges being parallel to HP in one of the position and in the third position it will be parallel to VP. So draw the square lamina, go for line option, use the visible. So 30, 30, so 30 by 30 square lamina. You have to name the square A, B, C and D. Show the dimension. It is a square lamina. So first position, the top view that is below the XY line is appears as a square. So it is a square lamina of 30 by 30 mm. So draw the front view. Project it, use the projection line, project it onto XY line. Again, use visible, draw the visible from. So viewer will be here if you want to write the front view. So A is visible, B is visible, C and D will be hidden. So name the front view. A is visible, so front view is A dash and D dash we have to write within the brackets. B dash is visible and C dash is within the bracket. Second position, instead of giving inclination with respect to HP, he has given information that the top view will appear as a rectangle of 30 by 20 mm with one of longer side of the rectangle parallel to HP. Here AD is parallel or resting on uh, HP. So that edge again, so this should be 30 mm. So other side is 20. So the square looks like a rectangle in the second position. Okay. So here A dash, B dash, C dash, and sorry. It's a top view. So it is A, B. C and D. Okay, now project. Use the projection line. Project onto XY line. This you extend. Okay, this A dash to B dash measures 30 mm. So go for arc by center with A dash as the center. Radius equal to 30 mm. Cut an arc. Now use the visible line and join it. 
use line option. Now measure the angle. So go for arc by center point. Take radius as 30. Cut an arc. Then use line option. Join it. This should be visible line. Okay, measure the angle. Angle is 48 degree. Okay, remove the extra projections. So now name it. So this should be a dash in bracket D dash. So this point should be B dash in bracket C dash. So second position is over. And he says that in the third position, AD will be parallel to VP. So go for move option. Select. Move it. You should keep a copy. Then rotate. Select A to D. You should not keep a copy. Place it. So move to a convenient location. Okay, now use line, projection line. Project A, A dash, B, with B dash, C, C dash, and D on the X, Y line. Use the visible line A, B, C, D, and A. Now name it. So this is A dash, B dash, C dash, and D dash. Finally, they have asked you to find the inclination with respect to HP and VP. So if this is, they have asked, then you have to draw the side view where you get the inclination with respect to HP and VP. Okay, draw a XY line. This is X1, Y1. So take the projection line. Okay. Wherever top view is there, draw a 45 degree line. Minus 45. Now project A is here onto 45 degree line. Whenever they intersect, A to A dash. B, B dash is here. C, C dash and D with D dash. Now use the visible line. So connect. Okay, now measure the angle. 48 degree. Use the projection line. Measure the other angle. That should be 90 minus. So this should be 42 degrees. So inclination with respect to HP is 48. Inclination with respect to VP is 42. So now name this. 
so this is a double dash since it is a side view a double dash will be within the bracket you can see d double dash c double dash in bracket b double dash so this is the complete solution for the given problem okay thank you